ye ma mu nyina ha e ma mo akwa ba e ba united television so ye prof to breka se bo di fi o man mu ana fama hudo bi so ni aso no so ye de asu mu ka se bo yi e di fi o be ka dian se se pawo so e wo en kan dstv ko be nya o channel 360 samsung facebook and social media ha de saudo ni nyina ne ka se bo yi e twagu e wo ho de be di ma kutini bi ene se abasobo juma die bi akoso e fa de urubo ene de obonwe ku ahodo ho na despite media ya ji bebere sanso ena ye wura for addiction so ya bo na ba so se ye ka obi a wo di mu e wo de obadwuma kuo no hihie mu ne ntutuye mu a o manga da ha de obi a ene no ense ye ma pene nana adodan kweku fo adon so ko be kwa ya ayar sabia bi o ho no wakokotwa homa mu ama ji se be ye adwuma ena ma pene da mahama so ya tudie chemu se ye si ye e wo america man mu ne gana fo so ye so bebi e fa film e fa aba na sen wo mu eto ye no we any summer who do be and I'm a de Bram Sakas. But no mono, I said a PSA ever come my boy for my daughter, my genome, Betty, made the Cassibo Bram a bribia. Best point can who be best assurance can home. You two and Chinin so Eddie Marcotin, Sanso and a this way chocolate drink and then the coffee drink. This way non dairy tea cream and we are Mokwada and one day I shall in my special ice in Sio, the water to a moon, no sashay moon, your son is a Korean special drink in it, the one more, and when the Pedrian and one day can now special energy no more. Carefi, na wo na wo say no. And if you need to force me, no na ya kradu. Need to be quiet. Igumu hudo mi no. Ba ku anwa apreka kese wum. Ba ku anwa apreka kese ni mi ni na kahudi. Ena ma ya di di so ti mu content and tempa. O ma daro ma ena di kese boye abremu. Mi amu sum ena uye mi di adi eja kwabina. Afi kese boye mu sum ni. Yema peni hixa salensi na naro dan kwa kufuado a kwa kwa daju me diye bi edi ewa asati bekwa e ningi nani se ayarase biye biya ewa hono ya shase ache ye pa nansu pri pri ya tumye uye ama wakwa dene di sa manfu hono enfanyye juma. Today is indeed a very happy day for residents of bekwa e because the project which started during the era of the late military head of state, General I.K. Achampo, has finally been brought to completion four decades later by the government of Nana Adodankwa Akufu Ado. This ceremony is further evidence of government's commitment to continue with and complete successfully major infrastructure projects that were inherited from previous governments so that expected socio-economic benefits can be enjoyed by all. Our pledge to provide quality infrastructure for all is continuing in earnest. Having stalled in 2013 due to lack of funds, government through the dynamic, hard-working Minister for Health, the Honorable Kwaku Ajima Menu, Member of Parliament for Doma Central, successfully negotiated for funding from the United Kingdom Export Finance for the completion of the civil works, procurement of equipment with a three-year warranty period, and the training of required personnel for the operation of the hospital. This hospital has been constructed at the cost of 22 million 330 million euros and has been fitted with all the modern facilities. The Nano government is committed to improving access to essential and quality health services through the provision of the necessary health infrastructure, equipment and logistics including the deployment of appropriate technology as part of our drive to attain, attaining universal health coverage. I want to reinforce the call to the administrators to embrace and strengthen the culture of maintenance. This edifice has been put at great cost to our nation and we should be in the position some 10 years down the line to see it still in good condition. It should not fall in the ways in which several institutions like this in Ghana have gone. The leadership of this facility must set the example for its periodic and constant maintenance and will be held accountable for this. Let me commend once again 
the Ministry of Health and the Ghana Health Service for the great efforts they and their teams have put into the completion of this hospital. We shall continue to sustain our agenda of building a robust, resilient and sustainable healthcare system for current and future generations.